problem solving. In this module, you will learn how to solve the word or story problems. Alicia is solving an addition word or story problem given in a home assignment. In order to solve the word or story problem, Alicia is going to use the following steps. 1. Read the word or story problem and understand its meaning. 2. Find the relevant information in the problem. 3. Think of the operation to be used. 4. Solve the problem using the decided operation. The word or story problem is A bag has 24 red marbles and 13 blue marbles. How many marbles are there in the bag? Step 2 After reading the word problem, she understands that there are marbles of two different colors in one bag. Therefore, she has to find out the number of marbles which are there in the bag. This is the relevant information. Step 3. In order to find the number of marbles, she needs to combine all the marbles together. Therefore, she decides the operation to use, that is, addition. Step 4. Now, she adds the number of marbles using the decided operation, that is, she adds 24 and 13 together. She gets to know that there are 37 marbles in all in the bag. Let's see another example of problem solving. Step 1. To solve the given word problem, first read the word problem and understand it. There are 16 diyas with Sid and 12 diyas with Alicia. How many diyas do they have in all to decorate the house on Diwali? Step 2. After reading the word problem, we understand that there are 16 diyas with Sid and 12 diyas with Alicia. We need to find out the total number of diyas. This is the relevant information. Step 3. In order to find the number of diyas, we need to combine both of their diyas. Therefore, we decide which operation to use, that is, addition. Step 4. Now, we add the number of Sid's diyas with Alicia's diyas together to know the total number of diyas. 16 and 12 is equal to 28. 28 diyas are there in all to decorate the house on Diwali. Let's recap. In order to solve the word or story problem, we can use the following steps. 1. Read the word or story problem and understand its meaning. 2. Find the relevant information in the problem. 3. Think of the operation to be used. 4. Solve the problem using the decided operation.